When Boeing starts flooding the runways, you can be sure there's always a very good reason for it. This 747-8 intercontinental freighter is about to make a big splash. An important test, one of the requirements in the certification process. A form of colored liquid soap is applied to show where the water hits the aircraft. We don't want uh, possible water ingestion. We don't want it going into the ports and clogging them. For the new Lufthansa 747-8 Intercontinental, a lot depends on the results of this water spray test. It affects whether the world's longest commercial plane is actually allowed to take to the skies. So we do the water spray test so that we can tell whether or not if an airplane's going through uh, standing water, whether water actually gets ingested into the engines. We have to go through and demonstrate that uh, in all these different circumstances that the aircraft is uh, safe and flightworthy. Each phase of the test is precisely documented. The test aircraft plows through the water at 30, then 40, and finally at 50 knots. Although it may look playful, this actually provides engineers with vital information. When we run through the trough and the water hits it, we can tell uh, where the water has hit the body. So you can be sure that for the future, you'll be sitting in an absolutely watertight Lufthansa 747-8 Intercontinental. And that's a good reassuring feeling.